Why do I like the ball work program? Because it's hard and it's a total body workout. It targets all areas of my body, big muscles, small muscles, things that you don't normally target when you're warming up, doing any kind of static stretching. And it's difficult. It's really hard and it's fun and uh, it's a challenge and it's easy to step up from level to level as you constantly improve on your movements. When I was younger, having to go through ballet, we were taught so many different movement patterns with our arms, with our legs. There are so many components to it. Proper posture alignment, core strength, muscle flexibility, joint mobility, how to control your limbs in space in different ranges of motion, different planes of movement. All those things are taught from the time you're a kid, so then when you go out and try to play sports, you already have an awareness of how to use your body. What we do in this country is, in every sport, is our kids are just thrown into sport and then they just got to figure it out. It's not too hard to figure out that you're going to give your child an advantage if you can teach them all those things before they even play their sport. The ball work program is very good for that because it adds some other elements to it. By adding low weight to it, we're able to stretch and strengthen while we're doing the program. So I can ballistically load the arms or the legs throughout a range of movement or a plane of movement and I can muscularly balance a body very quickly that way. So it also teaches muscular speed of contraction. And that's the body's ability to move something in space very quickly. And that is always the defining ability of any athlete. The other thing that it's really good for is that the torso stabilization, the core strengthening, because it challenges you in so many different ways to strengthen your core, your obliques, your lower abdominals, your entire spine, that you can get uh, improvement in your core strength instantly. And it comes very quickly in terms of there's no risk of injury because all we're doing is laying on a ball unless you're planning on rolling off the thing. And you're able to dynamically challenge the athlete in so many different ways. And the other thing is you're not going to miss any part of their body. It doesn't matter whether it's their legs, their arms, their core strength. All of it is going to get addressed with the ball work in a dynamic fashion, an athletic fashion. In terms of improving athletic ability, it's a very efficient way to address physical abilities. Well, for general fitness, it's probably the easiest method because, again, the limitations of how many different exercises you have to try to do, how many different machines you have to do to try to get a certain look to you, it's all proportion. So by addressing the muscle balance, muscle symmetry of the body, you get a much better look to the overall physique because you're addressing muscle tone, muscle density, the elastic nature of the muscle complex, as opposed to just blowing it up which to me is never the, you know, the best look to it. That's what we're trying to achieve with that is a very strong, tight core muscular structure that the arms and legs can stretch against all the time. And if you can do that, you get a very good appealing physical look to it. The ball work works for modeling and being a professional athlete because it doesn't bulk up your muscles. You can get strength and elongate your muscles, which you do by stretching the muscles with the different exercises. So you build lean, long muscle, which helps with the long, sexy legs, which helps with the core. And I mean, it shows in your pictures. You're not gonna get the giant thighs and the huge arms. So I'm still able to perform and look beautiful in my pictures. <laughs> or try.